It's December! December! Woohoo! Okay, it's not really December yet, but it's like in a couple of days, it's gonna be December. And I'm super pumped for Christmas! <sighs> oh my god. Uh, so, November is ending. December is beginning. Beginning. And you know what that means. My really crappy wrap up and TBR videos, because, well, they're not crappy, it's just that I never do them. <laughs> So, going to make an effort this time and do it. Like, wrap up is like, it's embarrassing guys. It's really embarrassing, I'm sorry. I've just got two books and I don't know, stuff has been going on. I've been working, I've been going to school, I've been doing stuff, I've been playing the violin. I mean, it's just, phew. Okay, I've got two books. The first one is The uh, Shadow and Bone by Lee Bardugo. It is the first book in the Grisha trilogy. And it is about a girl named Alina. She unlocks some kind of like power or whatever. It's unique and that gives her a direct hall pass to the uh, kingdom's like magical elite. They're called the Grisha. Cause they're like so cool and you know, whatever. You probably already read this or heard about it at least. <coughs> if you don't know, Lee Badugo is like queen. And I went sort of the wrong way reading her books. I started with Six of Crows and then uh, Crooked Kingdom and I sort of spoiled myself for this book, but who cares? I forgot about it anyway. I read that book like a year ago. So, and then I read Language of Thorns like a couple of weeks ago or days, whatever. I don't know. Uh, I really, really enjoyed Alina. So yeah, I enjoyed her like as a character. She's probably my favorite in the whole book. The next book that I read for the month of December for the month of um, November was this book, The Graveyard Book by Neil Gaiman, and holy freaking crap, if you have not read this book then please go and read it because it's so great, it even won like an award, I can't remember what it, what, what's it called, can I read it like this, uh, kill it, kill it, kill it, Carnegie medal winner, whatever, but it's really good, I really enjoyed it, it's about a boy called Nobody Owens, and he lives in a graveyard and yeah, <laughs> there's a man who s sort of killed his family and his name is Jack and there's like really cool illustrations in this book. I really enjoyed reading it and it's a bit creepy and yeah, you know, but this is the man Jack. He's super disgusting and scary. And I mean, I really enjoyed it. It is a middle grade book but it is so worth reading even as an adult. I really enjoyed it. I don't normally read Neil Gaiman. I mean, I, I don't know because I I read, which one have I read? Um, Ocean at the End of the Lane, I read that and then I was just like, okay, I'm gonna be reading a lot of Neil Gaiman. Moving on to the TBR bit of this video because my wrap up is just embarrassing. <laughs> I'm going to be reading this awesome book that I got. Okay, I just I just really need to gush about this book, okay? <coughs> Can you understand how happy I am that I own this book? Can you understand how happy I am? It's just crazy. Oh my god, I love V.E. Schwab. I always do this. I do this the wrong way. I always do it the wrong way around. I first read this Savage Song in our dark duet, and now I'm reading this. It's just... I don't know, I haven't even got a hold of Vicious yet, but you know, I just, I just always read them in the wrong order. But anyway, this is the um, collector's edition of A Darker Shade of Magic by B.E. Schwab, and it is just perfect. I just found it in the shop and I was just like, oh my God, I need to get this now. I was actually gonna go and get another book, but then I was just like, wait, is that A Darker Shade of Magic collector's edition? I was just like literally drooling in the shop. I was just like, Go away from it! Or get of course, it's like totally worth it because have you freaking seen? Wait. Have you seen? Bam! Bam, I tell you. And that's not like the only thing. Look, look, look. Bam! Our dark duet signed. Can you understand how happy I am? Like, can you understand? Look, look, look. Ah! So now I have two books by V. Schwab and let's sign. Oh my God. Well, I do have, I do have three books, but I mean two of them are signed. Do you, do you understand how happy I am? 
<sighs> okay, so yeah, that is the first book I'm going to be reading for the month of December. The second book I'll be reading in the month of December is The Night Circus by Erin Morgenstern. Don't you always like go go there, you know, Shadowhunter World? Don't you always go there with Erin? I do. Every time I'm talking about this book, I go directly like Cassandra Clare, Shadowhunters, you know, Morgan Stern. Have you seen this cover, by the way? It is so pretty. I love this cover. I found it like on uh, Book Depository. Book Depository. <laughs> And I was just like so happy about this because I know the other ones and I like the other ones but I like mine better because mine is so cool. Plus the best thing about it is that there's like stars in the back. I freaking love stars. I don't know if you know. I mean I've got like, wait hold on. I don't know if you can see it but I've got a tattoo there, stars. It's for me and my sisters. I'm the biggest star and then my younger, two younger sisters are the stars. Under my, yeah, you, you get it. You're the third book on my TBR for December is Just Blood by Ellie Blake. I think her name is, yeah, Ellie Blake. And no, I have not read it yet. I know that the second book is like out already, and yeah, you know, but I'm bad at this, okay? Accept it. I read books really, really late. I'll catch up eventually. And I've heard so many great things about this book. My uh, friend and her boyfriend, they were just like, oh my god, you have to read it, it's so great, and you know, yeah, so, I'm gonna read this. If I have time, I'm gonna be reading The Kiss of Deception by Mary E. Pearson, because no, I haven't read this yet either, but the best thing about this book is like, it's like one of these floppy editions, I love it, it just stays open, like always, you can do whatever you want, it just stays open on the page you're at, it's amazing, this is what I completely love about this book. So yeah, the month of December, TBR, done. Okay, you okay? I'm okay. If you have any like great book recommendations or something for me, then please comment down below and tell me which books you want me to read for next year. Looking forward for Christmas, because Christmas is the best time of year. Oh my God, I'm gonna fall. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Oh yeah, by the way, um, I'm like really close to the camera, I'm gonna move up now. <laughs> uh, yeah, so I decorated a bit for Christmas and there's like these super rude balls hanging <laughs> on my bookshelf. I just, I fell in love with these, I thought they were so funny, so yeah, I got them. <laughs> They're so rude. So if you like this video then please click the thumbs up button or subscribe and yeah. Stay tuned for more craziness.